Good morning, everybody. It's 8.04 Pacific Standard Time and 11.04 Eastern Time. I have a 60-minute chart that we have been calling for a reversal on the S&P 500. Now, this is the MMT uh, Turbo 60-minute chart on the tops in this uh, uh, S&P 500 that has started its uh, reversal after a huge, huge run. Um, what I am going to do is I'm going to point out up here where that 2175 is that major resistance level. And here is the 60 minute bar on the opening bell. And we're down here at 2164. Yes, we're going to hit some areas that will have support. We called for this top. Uh, last week and what that S&P 500 would look like buying the 21 weekly 2175 puts. This is the MMT platform. Um, I'm going to also show in the MMT market maker platform. I'm going to hit these diamonds very quickly. Uh, this is a market maker. It's a daily chart on S&P 500 in the uh, market maker application and basically when we called for these tops we're going to talk about these tops right here and we're going to just talk about um, where the deltas are in our system and basically as we talk about this um, we are basing everything on mathematical the S&P right now is at one IR, is as weak as you can get. A 16th value in our system, each one of these lines are 5.94. And I'm going to go ahead and populate some more trend lines on the S&P. And this way, um, as I show you the topping pattern on the daily, um, this is what it looks like right now. And we called for the reversal. This is back on the 60 minute chart right here. This right here in the MMT is what we call the MMT daily. And you can clearly see up here where that wall of resistance is, meaning that we're in earnings season. We ran too far too fast and we're gonna have a nice pullback. And that is the advantage of buying put options for the S&P to go down. And we called this last week. Clearly, one of the things that we're also talking about from last week, we said that this top was being put in, and it was. And we had a great trade on the put side, uh, 2175 puts. We came right back up, and now this is a 60-minute chart. Remember, everything is done mathematically. Um, the platform pulls data and then translates that into the exact movements that indexes, stocks, whatever you want to call it, are going to come down. And this is part of the, the volatility. The intraday right here is a daily 10-day uh, simple moving average. And basically, when we stay right here with that, one of the oops, excuse me, one of the things that we're going to point out is when to be short and when not to be short. Okay, and on the daily, we definitely have that reversal that we called for, and we're updating it right now as we speak. This is the S and P 500. It's called. $2,175 put options. They were cheap down here and we started buying them up last week. Now, 90% of option traders don't know how to trade the S&P 500 put options or call options and they pay the biggest and the most amount of money. And so when we started buying these at $6.60 over here, now we're up here to $13.80. They were totally deflated. Now, once again, this is a 60 minute chart of the actual um, put options on the S&P 500. 90% of the people that trade options have never even seen a call chart or put chart. And when markets are overvalued uh, and whatnot, 
we have six dollars and sixty cents entry here these are going to go a lot higher this is the 2175 put options that we bought last week three days ago today we're up one of the things about that s p 500 put option value is that once again um i'm going to show you exactly why and what it really means in dollar terms this is a daily chart of the 2175 put on nas or uh, s p so when we come back over here and we look at um the s p and we're looking at the s p directly right here you can see right here that the close on Friday was 770. Today's low 6.4 and the high on the S&P 13.7 for the 2175 weekly put options. And why are we so great at it as market makers and get these huge moves and these intraday price levels? And why is it that the... Um, S&P 500 was in the volatility here on the 60-minute chart today. That's why the put options paid. They did the same thing over here. And just remember, the other side of the market to the call side paid real good here. But now we have what we call a double uh, reversal on a 60-minute chart. I've covered the um, S&P 500 uh, put options they are 1320 by 1490 intraday level, and we have a great move at 5.6. Once again, in the weekly um, format that we do in weekly options, we're market makers. We're going to take you right through every single entry, every single exit. All you have to do now is join that live trading room, and you will be in.